Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing the Wish for the Night. Also, I have a new dance coming out um, to the song Rebel by Ann Wilson today or tomorrow. So I'm super excited for you guys to see that. Um, but yeah, the direction we're using is the Perfect Drive for Kids, but I recommend Flash. My mom has one, it's really good age. I mean, it's a really good book. <laughs> and it is by Rick Warren and Andrew's 365 versions. So yeah, that's what it looks like. So yeah. We're on day 289. I haven't done it for a few days because I haven't felt like it and I wanted to do it off camera with God, so I hope you understand. But yeah, the title is Weakness Expected, and the scripture is Proverbs 30, verse 8 to 9. So uh, let's just get started, but let's pray first. Lord, please bless the person who watched and please bless me, bless my words, and then be yours, not mine. In Jesus' name, bless them. Amen. Proverbs 30, verse 8 to 9. Keep falsehood and lies far from me. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Give me only my daily bread. Otherwise, I may have too much and disown you and say, Who is the Lord? Or I may become poor and steal and so dishonor the name of my God. Now, this is a devotion. Don't get discouraged. The comic book became the comic book hero Superman has one weakness, Cry Cry Krypton. I don't know. I, I don't know what it is. I, I don't know. I don't will do super books. <laughs> he said he stays as far as away from the power second rock as he can. Everyone, even superheroes, has weaknesses. The writer of Proverbs knew his weakness with money. If he had too much or too little, it would get in the way of following God's ways. So he prayed about it, asking God to protect him from that weakness. Do you know what makes your weakness? If you do, how far would you stay away from it? You may like the thrill of having a hair in secrets. You may have a really strong desire to make lots of money one day and hoard your allowance. You may like bending the truth to get your way or persuade others to follow your ideas. If you don't know your weakness, it's okay. As long as you get older, you'll discover it. No, sorry. As you get older, you'll discover it. When you go, when you do, get God on your side as soon as possible to help you fight it. You don't want your kryptonite, kryptonite to take you down. Now the breath. Lord, we're not sure what our weakness is. Will you show us how to be on guard against the things that will hurt us or you? In Jesus' name, amen. Yeah, my weakness, I really would say my weakness is secular music because, like, it's so good sometimes, but, like, it's, it's secular. It's not for God. It it pleases Satan. If it's not God, it's Satan. There's no in between. It's God, Satan. No in between. Mm -mm. No way, Jose. So, you listen to music that glorifies God, but listen to music that glorifies Satan. Just saying. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much. Be blessed.